Hey guys, what's up? So, take a look at this. So, what you see in front of you are a couple of these uh, VCM clones you get on eBay. And uh, one is a good one, and one is a bad one. Well, I haven't opened it up yet, so I don't know 100% sure if it's good or bad, but I kind of started the process and I figured I'd film this thing. But so this is the original VCM clone I bought maybe like two years ago. I mean, I spent about 40 hours trying to get it to work. Like, it might work with other cars, but I'm trying to get mine to work with my truck, my Power Stroke 6 liter. And I always had errors, no matter what version. I tried, like, 10 different versions of IDS software. Um, and, let's take these off, I'll open this up. I'm going to show you the difference between the full chip design and the, uh, this cheapo one right here. So, this one was actually not a real, it's not a, it's a clone, but it's not a real clone. I'll show you that real fast. So, I want to show you the difference between the PCBs, the boards. So if you're going to get one of these, you're thinking about getting one of these, hopefully you'll take this information and, and learn from it, but is this, seriously, I spent probably at least 30 hours, I don't know, 30, 40 hours installing different software, VMware player, and I'm actually an IT guy, so I do this all day long for a living, you know? So, all right. All right, well, that's my screw. All right, so this is the, not a real clone. And I'll show you the difference here in a couple seconds between this one and the other one. And I'll show you what this one actually is. It's actually an emulator, it's not a real, like, clone like the, the Bosch drivers will not work with this. This is its own separate thing. It's made by a company called uh, VX, uh, VX Nano. Or not VX Nano, but VX Diag. And they basically sell like a, an emulator. They create special drivers which is supposed to work with like most of these you know uh, proprietary like uh, engine control things. So this is the main thing. So I had to spend a little extra money for this one and Because they actually showed the picture of the, uh, so I might have to take this thing off, that sucks, but, but what's also funny is I actually, I already knew this when I bought this one, like which one to get, but I got scammed. The picture didn't match what they actually sent me, and it came from China. Whereas this one, actually, the guy that I bought it from, it was uh, Czechoslovakia. So if you look for the ones that are either coming from, from England, or the UK, Germany, or some somewhere in Europe. Because they actually seem to send me the, the real ones, but I don't know yet. I haven't opened this head yet, so I don't know. You saw me take the quality sticker off, so... Okay, now you can see the difference. This is called the full chip design. So if you ever see these, and you hear, you hear see them refer to a full chip design, well this is what it is. This is actually more of a clone of the real Bosch one. Okay, let me try to get that back in that spot. So the Bosch drivers that come with IDS should actually work with this. I mean, obviously you can see there's a lot more chips on this thing. It looks like some sort of, uh, I can't tell that, it looks like an ARM processor. But, uh, open this up again. This actually also went up, it also came with an SD card. So this one actually might have had a sorry I haven't flipped around. So you can see a spot where they might have had an SD card right there. So I haven't tried this yet but since this is actually a clone of the the real one Okay, so there's a real Al Altera Flex chip in there. Yeah, obviously you can see there's a lot more chips. This costs a few more bucks, but... Uh, this is the one you're looking for. I'm hoping this will work. And if you, I'll be doing some future upcoming videos on this stuff, so... Just wanted to show you the difference between the two different versions of it. So I'm glad I didn't get scammed this time. So the reason why I bought this one, I thought I was going to get this one because they had the pictures of this one for this one. 
this thing has never worked right. It might work with the other cars, but I heard like the F-Series trucks don't work right for some reason, but I don't know if it's because the uh, the CAN bus, you know, the body security module has a kind of an unusual CAN bus for those years, at least for my truck. Yeah, it came with a uh, 4 gig uh, SD card in there, so... Kind of interesting. But, alright, I'll get this back together. And uh, in coming videos, I'll uh, do uh, install. But yeah, I just wanted to make sure this thing actually was the full chip. And that I didn't want to get ripped off like I got ripped off last time, so... Alright, hopefully this helps somebody. So, I'll put a link where you can get this thing. But, um, yeah, make sure you see this full chip design in the picture. But, uh, like I said, that doesn't always work, but... Yeah, this one is actually, like I said, it's made on, uh, based on VX Diag, which is basically like a software emulator. Which doesn't really, it's, I've never got it to work. I get like a test error and I made other videos about it. But, uh, hopefully this one will work and we'll, we'll do some tests on it in the future. Alright.